there's more to life. There's a wide open space waiting. We'd like you to experience the bush the right way. It's a great way to learn about yourself and about our great rugged country. The land needs young people. Our beef industry is doing well and we're searching for young people to enjoy sharing the satisfaction of hard work in a healthy environment. If you're city bred or country born, head for the paddock and the saddle. Come and give us a hand. Right means jobs and training. We're putting young people back on the land with a new future. Let's take a look at what the day might hold. If you're on a property, you'll be taking on lots of different tasks. Your host employer will probably discuss what you're setting out to do over a good breakfast. There's so much to do, you never get bored. You learn core industry skills and how to make a decent campfire in Billy T. You might learn to drive heavy machinery like tractors and trucks, to dig holes for fence posts, clear fence lines or cut cattle. You can learn about different properties under different supervisors in different geographical environments. Our trainees go on to become head stockmen, overseers, station managers and pastoral inspectors. You may even want to own a property. It's easier to learn useful and important skills when you're actually on a property, working as part of a team. There's always fencing to be done or repaired. Better get an early start before the pickets heat up. It's a great bodybuilder and you get faster driving those pickets in. When you're mustering, you might be on horseback for eight hours. You need a good horse. To have a strong horse with a quiet temperament, you'll need lots of contact. You'll enjoy handling your horse and rewarding him with a rub down and a spell. You might need to clean their hooves. If you're on a property where they breed horses, you might be starting them. It takes a while to train your horse to work with cattle. You learn to block up cattle while you're mustering. After mustering, you take off the saddle, check their backs for marks, then wash off the sweat from the day's work. Right trainers and the host employers jointly ensure that the training is of a high standard. This partnership between us can be a short-term stepping stone or you can go from trainee to overseer, head stockman and station manager. This is a real possibility. Horses and motorbikes are used for mustering. Just pushing the cattle along steadily is the best part of the job. You get to soak up the atmosphere, the freedom and the quiet. Motorbikes are useful and you've got to learn to be handy on a bike and how to maintain it. You may need to head out on your own or in a pair to the dams and troughs and radio back how many headed cattle you have and where you're walking them to. By handheld radio they'll tell you what paddock to head for as you regroup and take them in. You learn to ride well. You don't want to stack it on an anthill in long grass. You learn to keep one eye on the ground and one eye on the cattle, especially if you're chasing a Mickey bull. You have to know how to maintain a four-wheel drive and how to change and fix a tyre. You learn to keep your motorbike running well, to check your oil and fuel before you set out. You don't want to conk out and have to walk 20 kilometres back to the homestead. Maintaining a good water supply is essential on a property. You regularly check your windmills, dams and bores to see how much water you have. You make sure the pumps are working and fix them if they're not. You ride out to check the water levels in the cattle troughs.
host employer will teach you about identifying pasture. You'll learn what condition it's in and how much you have, so that you can work out your protein levels. Sometimes you need to do mechanics in the workshops of the place. You need to be competent at welding. You'll need it for fixing and building gates, making a crush, or just building something for the yards. You may need to use a chainsaw. If you'd like to live and work on a cattle property in Queensland or the Northern Territory, and you've passed year 10, a rural traineeship could start you on a full-time career in the rural industry. When you're drafting, you learn to handle the cattle in the yards. Yard work involves catching the cattle, vaccinating, castrating, branding or earmarking. Or you might be dehorning so you don't get bruising when you transport them later on. Wright can provide you with a qualification that is genuine and recognised by industry employers Australia-wide. If you've got a spare moment, there are lots of small jobs just waiting. Keeping the yards clean, repairs and making sure everything is working. What about a school-based traineeship? We train young men and women between 15 and 25 who are fit, energetic and have a desire to make a career on the land. A school-based traineeship means that when you finish school, you're already qualified and employable. Our graduates are in demand. While you're with Wright, you'll be well-fed and cared for. You'll become fit and strong and have the chance to save money. It's not all floods, droughts and poor prices in the bush. There's more to rural areas than hardship. There's the wildlife, the scenery and the friendliness on properties. When you're not working, you fish, water ski, swim, play sport, go to rodeos, camp out, do something adventurous for yourself. Working on a property gives you independence and the ability to work in an enthusiastic team. You can have a first-hand view of a property anywhere from Birdsville to Cape York to the Barclay Tableland, if you take the right opportunity. Win the respect of other people make close friends and hold great memories. There's so much to learn and experience in life. Learn it from the land.